I've been using the Bitscamp trading bot for over six months now, and I've had some amazing results with some of these bots. But the question is, is it better to use these bots or just use a simple buy and hold strategy for tokens you like, coins you like on normal crypto exchanges? We'll be exploring the grid trading bot and the pricing plan I use and see how these things work and if it is worth it in this video. As usual, though, none of this is financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Knowledge. Now, if you know what Bitscap is, just skip down to the timeline down below. We're actually going to my results. If you don't know what Bitscap is, it is a trading platform where you can have a couple different trading bots. Now you can see I use the grid bot, which follows small price fluctuations in the crypto bot. And we'll go over in detail how it trades these price fluctuations. The pricing for this grid bot is I have their basic plan, which gives me two active grid bots. But the advanced version gives you five active grid bots, meaning you can select five different coins. And then it has trailing up and down for the bots. So you do select a price range on the bot. And then with the advanced program, it will trail up and down for the bots depending on that price range and the current price. But I use the basic. So my results will be based on the basic plan and not the advanced plan. So just keep that in mind. So now we're in the grid bot and you can see I currently have a XRP USD bot running on Coinbase. And I started this one pretty recently, about a month ago. And so far it has made me 2.78%. Now, while the bot has made 5.1%, we can see my current position in XRP is down. These are spot bots. So what that means is they're actually buying the crypto. So this is buying XRP and trading with these small price fluctuations. Now you can see on here, I have green. That means buy, red means sell. So it means it's buying and selling as it moves up and down within this grid that I selected. So in the basic plan, you can pre-select the grid and how many steps you want it to trade. And the more advanced plan, the $55 per month, that one will track the movement up and down and the grid will move along with it. So the, my results are based on a fixed position for these bots. So just keep that in mind. So as of now, XRP is treating me well, right? My entry price was up here, 0.62 cents. Right now, XRP is trading 0.59, but my overall position is up because it's been trading these up and down price fluctuations. And the current market of crypto is just dumping right now is today on 4 to 24. So if all that were like this, it'd be like, yeah, you know, it's doing really well. I'm up 2%, even though I'd be down when I bought this position. But if we look at my history, we can see I've had a lot of crypto bots running. Originally they were on Kraken, then I switched to Coinbase. So let's go through some of these and see what would have made more sense. Just buying that crypto with the money or using the trading bot. So let's go to my one of my very first ones, which was a BTC USDC bot. And I put in 1300 in this bot and I made a 4.79% gain a total PL on this Bitcoin bot. And we can see where it started right here. So you can see my low price was down to this dip and my high price was up here on the current swing high in July. Let's put it like that so you don't know what you're seeing. So my guess was we might be consolidating a little more. So I selected this range for trading in here. But as of course, you can see when I started the bot, it was doing pretty well sideways, sideways for about five, 53 days. And then guess what? That's when Bitcoin shot up and we mooned to where we are currently. So within that time period, yes, the Bitscap trading bot was doing really well. And it probably would have kept doing well if we had the trailing up and down because it would have moved along with the price. But the problem with the basic version is it's not gonna capture the pumps because the price is gonna move along with it. And since then we've had 150% gain at the time of the current dump in the market right now. So for the time being, yes, that was a good trading bot, but then it quickly left my price zone. If we look at my ETH bot, it's a similar story. I had a 10% gain in two months and 21 days. And my entry price, let's see, was right around back here. So there were periods. You can see I did a similar thing. Swing low, swing high. I was expecting consolidation and then it pumped. And within that time period, when exit the price range is at about a 26% gain. So it traded really well, but then it exited and then the market pumped from there. So within a 26% gain from where my entry point to the high price, the bot very the bot underperformed very drastically. I only got a 10% gain with all these trades other than the huge pump. So with the pumps, the bot is not going to be out trading a giant market pump like this, right? You can't out trade 100% gain when the market is just going to keep going up for time periods. For consolidation periods, yes, the market's going the bot's going to do well. But when it pumps, it's not going to track as nicely as I would have had better gains even in the same time period just buying and holding at even at the break even price at the high price even to now i would have done better if we look at a different bot i had a avax bot using coinbase at a 16 percent gain let's see my entry price during that time as we can see it was a similar story i 
entered here, expecting some consolidation, had the buy, it did a lot of trading, and then it exited my range when it reached 36% high. So even in this time period, if I bought AVAX on this candle, you can see the first trade, I would have exited with a 40% gain, even if it was at the high price. At the current price, I'd be holding a much larger gain. I'd be 124% since I started that bot. But even with the bot, I only had a 16% gain, which is less than even half that of what I would have had just holding the crypto. So it's not gonna be great on these tokens that are gonna pump, especially in this bull market right now. You can see the similar thing with Doge. I was expecting sideways consolidation, and then Doge pumped and just went straight up, and I would have probably had a 2x right there. Okay, 133% gain. You're not gonna out-trade that with the sideway market. But currently, with like XRP, that's currently what I'm doing because I do expect XRP to consolidate, although that's what I said with AVAX, Doge, Bitcoin, ETH. So my predictions have not been great, but that's just the point of these trading bots. So you're not going to out-trade tokens that are going to pump. You can see people over here are making like FET tokens, which is a current meme coin. I don't know why you're making these trading bots on a token that has 3x is probably going to 4x later. It has 4x, I guess, from that entry. You're not going to out-trade a 4x meme token. And keep in mind, guys, these are spot bots. So it means the money you put in, you are actually holding. So if you want to own a lot of FET, keep in mind when you put on these bots, you're going to be owning it, and that's actually trading it on your platform. Is training it on my Coinbase platform. So as of right now, I actually only have one successful bot that is beating the market from when I made it. And with time, I'm sure it's not going to beat it if XRP actually does moon. Like if we look at this candle, when I started the bot, that was a 25% gain in a couple weeks if I sold, which I didn't because that's not the bot strategy, right? So are you going to beat the market with these trading bots? Probably not, but this might be a good tool for you to utilize in circuit market conditions or certain coins that you know will probably trade sideways. I'm trying this on XRP again, and this will trade sideways. And this may be really good during other market sentiments as well. Like during this period right here, if we felt the dump was over during this period, we could have had almost a year of sideways action. So you could have been trading this the whole time, doing spot collecting, and then actually setting an entry point once it exits out your range, right? So if you saw this was the high, you could have traded for this period. And then when it exited out, you could have built your spot positions if that's a part of your strategy that you want to do. So I do think these have their place. I don't think you're going to beat the market with the bids gap trading bot, though, despite what many YouTubers say. I don't think you're going to beat the market with the current buy and hold strategy in the current bull market. And keep in mind, if you're like running one of these near the top and you select the whole range, you're still going to be down a decent amount of your position because you're buying all the way down trading, and then you keep buying, 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 and then eventually you're going to run out of money depending on the grid you selected because it is a spot trading bot. So it's spot, so you're buying. Now, with all that said, I do like the BitScat trading bot. I think it's a great platform. I think it can be utilized in a good strategy if you're really conscious of how you want to use it, what tokens you want to use, things like that. So I am leaving a referral link in the description if you want to try out BitScat for yourself. Invite your friend, you'll get 10 USD for the first purchase of a plan. I'll also get 30%. So thank you if you do decide to use one of these BitScap trading bots. Make sure to check out another video right here. Peace.